Hello again, here is Thomas Kinga, Arman Gebach Company, and today I'm talking about something very new and very special, our new flagship, you can see it in the screen here, the Thermal Map 600, the new scanner, with a lot of different features I have to show you. And let's start with a small presentation to show you what's possible with that machine. I just prepared here a database and you see here a small bridge with upper and lower. And now you see you have here scan mode here to choose here between a lot of different types. The first one is one stone model only. This means you only have one model. Let's say here this one and you have a mush bite for it. That's something like that fitting directly on your model. Then we have two stone models in Artic CR. You know our articulator here, the Artic CR. You can take also this articulator in the scanner. Then you can take here two stone models in articulator. This now means you can use different kind of articulators. For example, this is the Panadent articulator and for example another one this one this is the stratos articulator you can take this one in your scanner or you can take kinds like these ones in the scanner you know that is a very simple thing also this one articulate like articulator could be put in the scanner and you even could put these parts in you know this is our articulator for simple models here and you have this choice with these different articulators and for example you can even choose here the digital impression scan then you can put in this part here this is our triple tray holder which flips from inner to outer side and you can put in this one even when you want to have an all-in scan this means with two scans a complete full model with a die here placed in the middle of this universal plate and you even could use this one. You know that from the MAP 300 and the MAP 400. This is our transfer kit. This could also be using, used for putting it the model in the scanner. And how to work, I will show you now how it works with the placing the articulators in the scanner. Before you place your model in the scanner, you will see that there are two lines here. It's a single and a double line. And when you put in your model now, you have only to check if the model has the height till the second, the double line or the first line and then you only have to select this by the button in the scanner software. You see in the scanner software you have two buttons, the single line and the double line and after selecting here the scanner model moves automatically and starts with the scanning process. And now it's time to put the articulator in. And for the placement of the articulator, you have some special lines for the control. I want to show you in detail now. So you here see the bottom of the scanner here, and there is a medium line in the middle, and there is a back line behind the model line. And when you place now the articulator, you only have to check that the behindest point of the model points to this line, and that the middle of your model and the articulator points on that line. That's it. Also a nice help when you put in the articulator is this edge here and the part of the articulator backside fits exactly in that edge so it's really easy to take it in or take it out so then you are in the right place with the articulator. For every other articulators here you look the same and you check that the behind line of your model points to the line on the bottom plate of the scanner and that you are in the medium line here in the middle. And then you can start with your scan. And again here in our manual you can see how it works here. You see we have these both lines here in the scanner backside, the single and the double line. Then you select here in your software which line is the model on the height and here in the manual you see another picture which shows you how is the position of the articulator you see here the line number one this is the behind side of your model and the line number two this is the middle line of your articulator so it doesn't matter which articulator you use it's working all the same and here you can now select all the articulators in the scanner and afterwards you can also select the articulators in your software.
For example here, our standard articulator, the Artex CR, full adjustable, or here we have the BioArt A7 Plus, or we have the full adjustable A7 Plus, or we have the Dina Mark 330, or we have the Panadent, or we have the Prota from the Cavo company, and we have the SAM. So now it's up to your choice which articulator you want to use and then you put it in your scanner and you scan. And that was a short overview over our new scanner, the MAP600. Now have fun with that machine and enjoy the size, the speed, the preciseness and the flexibility. And on the other side there was Thomas Ginger, Amann Gerbach. See you again. Bye bye.